Hey everybody, it's Jen with Two Sister Bees. Today is going to be my weekly cash stuffing, but it's going to be a little different. Actually, it's gonna be a lot different, and I'm super excited because... Why? I went from being a beginner cash stuffer to a big girl cash stuffer. I have three binders now, and I am so excited to show you guys all the new categories and get to cash stuffing with you. This is new! If you're new to the channel, I have been cash stuffing for about five to six months, and I started off with just this binder, and I am now confident enough in myself and in my cash stuffing abilities that I can do this. Of course you can. So let's get started. The first thing I wanna do is count my cash and make sure that I have $2,400. The amount has gone up since I added more categories. So let's count it. Fifteen hundred, nineteen hundred, twenty two sixty, twenty three thirty, twenty three eighty five. Twenty four hundred cash is correct. Let's get to the good part. I think I'm going to start with my new wallet binder. got this from Amazon. I'll put the link in the description. I haven't actually used it yet, but so far I do like the way it looks. And that's all that matters. These are all new categories and I did get these envelopes from Etsy and the shop is called Coco Budgets and she did a great job and I'm very happy with them. She had very fast shipping as well. She sent me this Super cute $1,000 placeholder, and I already know where I'm gonna put it. And she also sent me this I Spy Something mini game, and I can't wait to use it. Back to the wallet cash stuffing. First one is gonna be gas, and what I have come up with is 35. I'm on a full tank as of today, and I think by the time I'm on the E, I will have enough for another full tank with 35 a week. So let's start with that. And all of these are going to be a learning process for me, and there's probably going to be some adjusting. But for now, we'll go with this. Real good plan, baby. Good plan. Groceries. This is going to be the toughest one for me. We're going to start with 200. This is extremely hopeful. If you've watched any of my other videos, I don't even know if this is possible, but I'm going to try really, really hard. And as we go a little further, you'll see why I think this may work. So 200 in groceries. Next is Little Giving. I live outside of the Sacramento area, and as everyone knows, California has a extreme homeless problem, and I see them every single day, and I wanna be able to give just a little bit when I see someone that I think could use a little extra help. Next envelope is just called me, and the reason I have this envelope is just for small little purchases that Maybe I'm not really counting on, but they're, they're there. So the next one is for house stuff. And this is where I get hopeful with my groceries because I'm going to start splitting up my house stuff from my groceries. So I'm going to be giving this one 20 a week. And I'm hoping that will keep my groceries lower and I will have a better idea of what I'm spending on just food. So next is miscellaneous, again, more of like an oops envelope. So, so we'll start with the five and we'll see how that pans out. And last but not least is the, my coins. And I love this envelope because I have so many coins just flopping around in my purse. Now I have somewhere to put them. Next, I'm gonna move on to the palm tree binder. This one is still going to have the same idea of the variable expenses, the monthly stuff just coming in and out. So this one, I've moved some of the envelopes from this one into my next third binder. So let's see where we're at now. Okay, so first as always is my husband. He gets his same $50. If you hear my dog crying, it is because the gardener is here and he sees him in the window. So I'm gonna to try to get through this with Uhtred crying in the background. So my husband is now up to 100, 200, 300, and 10. He did get his golf cart, and we are super excited, by the way. Here's a photo of it. We have had nothing but a great time on this thing. Every night we take it for a ride, 
and Uhtred loves it as well. Speaking of Uhtred, he is next. He gets 95. And if you're new, Uhtred is my English Bulldog who currently has an ear infection and I've been giving him so much medication. I feel like all I do is give this poor little guy pills, but hopefully he will start to feel better over the next day or two. If he does not, we all know where this is gonna go. The vet took care of that. Uhtred now has 100, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 270, 290, 310, 330, 350, 370, 390, 400, and 15. Next is my bougie envelope. I get 85. <laughs> 85. I did get my hair done yesterday. It really, really needed it. I feel so much better when I leave there. I'm sure everybody feels that way. I still haven't figured out my lash girl dilemma. <laughs> if you're a returning viewer, you know what I'm talking about. She is now 40 minutes away, one way, and I don't think I'm ready to commit to such a drive, but let's see what we're up to for now. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 256. Number one debt still gets 250. This is for a Visa card that I'm trying to pay off. It has now taken actually second string to the tax bill. So it is not my number one debt anymore. It is now my number two debt, but we'll leave the envelope alone. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 750. RV, this is for a principal payment, 55. So I send this in addition to the regular payment in the hopes that I can get it paid down as quickly as possible. 150, 65. Lawn, he gets 33. And let's see what he is up to. I think he might be ready for his quarterly payment. Fifty, seventy, ninety, one ten, one thirty, one fifty, one seventy, one ninety, two ten, two thirty, two fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, three hundred, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, sixty five, seventy, eighty, ninety, three eighty six. And he is ready for his quarterly payment. He gets $3.90, so I need to add $4. Next one is a new one. This is Jolene. This is our granddaughter. I have decided I want to start sending her some extra cash so that the kids can take her somewhere or whatever they want to do. And Lolly and Pop are helping out. So the next one is Big Give. This is a new one as well. This one I'm going to be putting in four weeks worth of payments. And at the end of the month, I'm going to give it to a different charity in the area here in Sacramento area. So this one is going to get 25 a week. Next is Mama D's bills. She gets 440. And I wanted to get a full month going in here, maybe even a month ahead, I'm not sure, before I start taking out of the envelope. So let's see what she's up to now. 1,000, 1,200, 1,250, 1,270, 1,290, 1,310, 1,330. So yeah, I'm gonna keep going on this one for a little while and uh, maybe go a month ahead. This is a new one as well. This one is closed and I added this because I don't really buy that many clothes for myself um, and neither does my husband. So fall is gonna be coming very shortly and it does get cold here. We're not in Florida anymore. So we do need jeans and sweaters and hoodies and all kind of stuff. So 40 bucks a week can't hurt, right? So that's all the envelopes that are in my variable monthly binder. Now let's move on to, this is the long-term goal binder. And this one, if you 
notice the cute little bee stickers. My sister made all of these. I think they're available in the Etsy store. I love the bee better have my honey, still my favorite one. So let's get into this one. Christmas is obviously a long-term goal and they still get 45. This should have close to 2000 in it by the time Christmas rolls around. If you've been following along, my kid does still owe 300 <laughs> to the envelope, but things are looking up for him. So I'll probably be seeing that payment very shortly. Let's see what Christmas has. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, eight, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty, fifty-five, sixty, sixty-five, seventy, seventy-five, eighty. So eight eighty plus those three hundred, we actually have eleven eighty. So yeah, I like having these split up now and not having them all together in the same binder. Next is medical, and this is where I'm going to use my new placeholder. Medical gets forty-eight. And let's see what it's up to. There's the thousand that we're going to use this for. So we are up to one thousand fifty six. And this is going to go into the bank. Next is my month ahead. They get an even $100. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, one thousand, eleven hundred, twelve hundred. So I've been saving for 12 weeks. Taxes gets the biggest chunk. I gotta do it. I have no choice. Let's see what they're up to. 1,000. 1,500. One more payment and I will send it in. Next is a new envelope. This is car insurance and registration, which is super expensive here in California compared to Florida. Car registration in Florida is about $40 a year, and here in California, it's almost $600 a year. So that definitely justifies an envelope. Neither one are due for about six months. So if I did my math right, $58 a week should get me where I need to be in six months. And I will be so happy when it is time and I can just take it from here. Next is my iPhone watch fund. This is a new one. Well, it's not so new anymore. I think I'm on my third week, but still kind of new. I to put two 16 into this one and September 1st, I will have enough to buy the phone and the watch. Obviously not brand new, um, but I did see them on eBay. I went by those prices and that's what I'm going with. So let's see how much I have. One, two, three, four, five, six, six, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, five, forty, forty, seven, forty eight, six, forty eight. Next is my Airbnb, and I have decided to up this one from twenty five to fifty. We are under a completely new management, completely new cleaning company. I'm not sure what's going to happen. And I just figured it couldn't hurt to add a little bit more. So we're up to 50, 70, 90, 110, 130, 150, 170, 75, 80, 85, 185. Now these last two that are in here, I am not adding anything to this envelope yet. This is for a hopeful second house that we want to purchase. We don't, we're not even sure if we want it to be in California or Florida, leaning a little bit towards California to be perfectly honest, but this is not getting started until I have other things taken care of and birthdays. If you've been here before, you know that I'm putting this one on pause. So those are my three binders. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, be a subby, watch out for our other videos that are right up here for you to watch and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.